Welcome to the plant disease application that recognizes plant disease from photographs captured by smartphones in the field where the plant exists without requiring an internet connection. In the particular preliminary version, the application was developed for Windows Phone 8 and 8.1. In this video, we will see the application in a simulation level using Windows Phone Emulator for better detailed capture. Grape leaves that have been infected by diseases like powdery or downy mildew, ESCA, etc. will be used. When the application starts, in the first screen the user can select the language of the interface. Let's choose English and then we press Next. In the screen that appears we can select the photograph that we want to analyze, which in the particular case is the image of a leaf infected by ISCA. In the particular application version, we assume that the photo was captured by placing the leaf on a much brighter background, like a marble in the garden or a sheet of paper. Since the lesion have a brighter color than the normal leaf, we check invert and select appropriate values for the threshold. the mean spot area and potentially the background. In order to separate the leaf from the background and the spots. The threshold shows in the gray scale how much the lesion differs from the average gray value of the leaf, while the background shows the gray level limit of the pixels that are assumed to belong to a lesion if they are brighter. The field mean spot area shows the minimum number of pixels that a spot should consist of in order to be considered as a spot rather than noise. When we pass, when we press Analyze, an image is produced with three gray levels for the different leaf areas discriminated by the application. Background is white, the normal leaf is gray, and the spots are denoted with black. A white halo of 3 pixels is assumed to exist around the spot. We can change these parameters and see how these areas are modified. For example, if we increase the threshold, then smaller area is recognized as lesion. By comparing the initial photograph, we can select the appropriate values for these parameters in order to recognize the correct lesion area. With the options Spot Color, Leaf Color and Hello Color, we can see the histograms used by the application for the disease recognition. At the bottom of the screen, we see some parameters recognized like the number of the spots, their area, their gray level, etc. In the next screen, some analysis uh, results are displayed that can be used by the application administrators like agricultural professionals in order to extend the app and support new diseases. In the next screen, the user selects the plant displayed in the photo here we can see the plants that are supported at any time. While in the next screen we select the plant part that was captured by the photo. Next the user can answer to additional questions that help uh, to reach a more reliable plant disease recognition. In the next screen we can define the location where the plant exists so that we can retrieve historical weather data that can be used for a more reliable plant disease recognition. Through GPS we can detect the plant location or we can give directly the coordinates if we already know them. Next we define for which dates we would like to retrieve weather data like average minimum and maximum temperature, average humidity, etc. This data can be used for a further validation of the disease detected in the previous analysis. 
For example, let's ask data for the 1st, the 15th and the 13th of July of 2016. Since the photos were captured in the August of this year. The 1st of July is set. The 15th of July. And the 13th of July. Next we can select if we are going to take into consideration this data in the analysis or not. If we do not want to take them into consideration, we can press results after checking the corresponding field. In the last screen we can see that three diseases with the highest score are listed. In the first position we find ESCA. Moreover, in the screen instructions can be found about the treatment of each disease. Let's go back to the second screen and select a different photo. Here the spots are smaller and darker than the normal leaf color, so the mean uh, area can be down to 20 pixels and we should not check the invert field. If we analyze the screen we see the appropriate parameters for the threshold. the spot color histogram, the leaf color histogram and the halo color histogram. Press next. Please note that since we did not terminate the application, the weather data retrieved earlier remains stored. In the results, we can see that the correct disease has been recognized. Either if we take the weather data into consideration or not, and this disease is downy mildew.